What's up guys and welcome to another transfer video on the channel, you already know there's no intro, we will go straight to the news but before that, let's try to reach 300 likes in this video so please smash the like button, don't forget to leave a like, also don't forget to leave a comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel, enjoy the video guys, let's go! Ok guys, let's start this Leipzig goalkeeper Mvogo has been loaned out to PSV for the coming two seasons, the two clubs have announced. Gael Klitschi leaves the Turkish club and is now a free agent. Wolfsburg has signed French defender Maxine Locro on a 4 year contract from the League 2 club. Taylor Richards has completed the season long loan move to Doncaster Rovers FC. Seville has loaned Berrocal to Mirandes for one season. Leicester City Academy graduate Luke Thomas has signed a new long term contract with Leicester City. Swansea have completed the signing of Wolverhampton midfielder Morgan Gibbs White on a season long loan. Valencia have confirmed that the club has reached a deal with Leeds United over the transfer of star striker Rodrigo. The duration of the contract is still unknown. Real Betis Balompié has signed Martin Montoya from Brighton with the defender returning to the side he represented on loan in 2016. Now it is official, Rome has announced the signing of Pedro on a free transfer until 2023. Antonio Conte is set to remain at Inter, the club has confirmed. The manager had been widely linked with the departure after criticizing the club, but Conte is set to remain on after meeting with the club executives. AEK Athens have announced the signing of Karim Hans Sarifard. He has previously featured for the likes of Nottingham Forest, Olympiacos and Osasuna. Bayer Leverkusen has signed Patrick Schick from Rome for 30 million euros. Schick impressed during his spell on loan with Leipzig last term, scoring 10 goals in 28 games. Leverkusen decided to reinvest some of the funds from Kai Havertz to improve their attack. And finally to finish the confirmations guys, Cardiff City has confirmed Jose Tutu on a season long loan from Arsenal. Now we start with the rumors, Everton are considering loaning Moise Keane back to Juventus as the mirror reports. The 20 year old has struggled to settle at Goodison Park and Carlo Ancelotti is ready to allow him to return to Turin for the duration of the 2020-2021 season. Moise Keane has only scored 2 Premier League goals in 29 games since joining Everton from Juventus for 31 million euros last summer. Valencia are closing in on the signing of Real Madrid striker Borja Mayoral, according to Mundo Deportivo. The bets are in contact with the 23 year old's agent over a possible transfer, but they must first sell either Rodrigo or Kevin Gameiro to raise funds for a proposed 15 million euros deal. Mayoral has spent the last two years on loan at Levante, who ultimately passed up the chance to sign him permanently at the end of the 2019-2020 campaign. Paris Saint Germain are considering moving on from Thomas Tuchel according to us. The German coach guided the Ligue 1 Giants to the Champions League final in 2020, but suffered defeat to Bayern Munich and could now make way for a new manager. Former Tottenham fullback Kieran Trippier is a target for Aston Villa claims the Telegraph. The England international is currently with La Liga Giants Athletic Madrid, but he could be lured back to the Premier League. Chelsea are ready to table a huge offer for West Ham star Declan Rice, claims Football Insider. The England international previously spent time in the Blues Academy system and could form part of Frank Lampard's elaborate spending spree in 2020. Juventus want to bring in Rome striker Edin Zeku to replace Gonzalo Higuain according to Calcio Mercato. The Bianconeri are ready to terminate Higuain's current contract, which frees up a spot in Andrea Pirlo's attack. Duvan Zapata, Milic and Raul Jimenez have all been linked with Juve recently, but Zeku has now emerged their first choice target ahead of the new season. Huddersfield have approached Manchester United over James Garner's availability, according to Football Insider. The Terriers are hoping to bring the 20 year old midfielder in on a season long loan, with the Red Devils expected to sanction his temporary departure. Celtic are looking to sign Ajax winger Noah Lang, but face competition from Ertel Berlin, Real Sociedad, and Villarreal, according to reports. 
The 21 year old scored a hat trick on his first Ajax start back in December and has come to the attention of clubs around Europe. Lang spent the start of 2020 on loan at Vente before the Eredivis was cancelled due to the coronavirus pandemic. Arsenal fullback Kolasinac is seeking a return to Schalke according to Sky Germany. The 27 year old wants to rejoin the German club on loan ahead of the 2019-2020 campaign. Kolasinac began his career at Schalke before joining Arsenal on a free transfer in 2017. Brighton will not sell Ben White to Leeds United at any price, reports Sky Sports. The Whites had been hoping to tie up a permanent deal for a centre-back that helped them to promotion during a loan spell in 2019-2020, but the Seagulls are reluctant to do business with a Premier League rival. Arsenal have snubbed an approach from Monaco for Emily Smith-Rowe, claims the Daily Mail. The highly rated playmaker who spent time on loan at Huddersfield last season is wanted by Liga and heavyweights on a permanent basis but the Gunners are reluctant to sell. Chelsea won 29 million euros for left-back Emerson who is surplus to requirements and interesting clubs such as Serie A giants Inter. The 26-year-old is ready to leave Stanford Bridge, having failed to convince Frank Lampard of his long-term worth with Marcus Alonso set to battle in pending new signing Ben Chilwell for a starting spot. Leicester City wants Ajax left-back Nicolas Tagliafico to replace Chelsea-bound Ben Chilwell, but Gianluca Di Marzio claims the Foxes face competition. Serie A side Napoli are also set to be keen on the Argentine international. Manchester City chairman Al Mubarak has said he is calm over contract talks for Sergio Aguero and Pep Guardiola. The pair have entered the final season of their deals at Etihad Stadium, with Al Mubarak hoping to enter talks over an extension soon. Lionel Messi has told Barcelona that he wants to leave the club, reports TYC Sports. The Barca star recently met with new manager Ronald Koeman, but remains unconvinced by the club's plans for the future. As a result, Messi has communicated to the club that he wants to leave after 20 years with the club. Everton are in talks to sign midfielder Ducure from Watford, according to Sky Sports. The 27-year-old wants to leave the Hornets after their relegation, but the two clubs remain far apart in their valuation. Watford are holding out for 39 million euros for Ducure. Crystal Palace are set to sign Eberichi Ize for 22 million euros, reports The Guardian. The 22-year-old attracted plenty of interest after scoring 14 goals in the championship last season, with Aston Villa, Fulham, Leeds United, West Ham and West Bromwich Albion also keen on a deal. Crystal Palace are also in talks with Mainz over a move for striker jean Philippe Mateta. New Barcelona head coach Ronald Koeman has told Ivan Rakitic he can leave the club, according to Was. Rakitic is hopeful of a return to former club Seville, who are eyeing the Croatian as a replacement for Ever Banega. Seville are looking to land Rakitic on a free transfer, which would require Barca cancelling a contract that has one season remaining. Now, could the Argentine move to Old Trafford, both Manchester United and Paris Saint-Germain could pull off the signing of Lionel Messi, claims Sport. The Barcelona star has ended in a transfer request, but any move away from the club would be expensive with PSG and United singled out as two clubs that could get a deal done. Real Madrid attacker James Rodriguez is close to sealing a move to Everton, reports The Telegraph. The Toffees have made an offer for the Colombian with talks progressing well between both clubs. Everton manager Carlo Ancelotti has previously coached James Rodriguez at Bayern Munich and Real Madrid. Lionel Messi once again has made contact with Manchester City manager Pep Guardiola and is open to a move to the 88 Stadium according to The Athletic. Despite those talks between the player and coach, City have strongly distanced themselves from a move for the 33-year-old. Prior to asking Barcelona for a termination of his contract, Lionel Messi phoned Neymar inviting him to join him and play for Manchester City, according to ESPN, George Nicola. And finally to finish the video guys, Bayern Munich CEO Rummenigge believes David Alaba will remain with the club. With the best will I cannot imagine that David wants to leave Bayern. 
Rummenigge told Bild via Sky Germany. We are very interested in him staying and I think he too feels at home at Bayern. We reached the end of the video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, like I said in the beginning, our goal for today's video is 300 likes, so please smash the like button, it only takes one second of your time and it is really really important for me and for this new channel to grow. Also don't forget to leave a comment down below, I always answer every comment in my videos and finally subscribe if you're new to the channel and if you want to keep following me and watching my content. Stay safe, I'm Default and I'll see you guys in the next video.